Hello people. Today we have a Browning model 1971 in 380 ACP. There we have the classic made in Belgian marking. There's the caliber 380. There's a Belgian proof marking. Serial number is 71N05527. That places the manufacturing of this pistol in 1971. So they only made these in 1971 to 1974. There's another proof marking. I don't believe this gun's ever been fired. It is in incredible condition. So if you're familiar with the model 1910 and 1922, when the Firearms Act of 1968 was implemented, a lot of companies like Browning had to make changes to get their product imported into the United States. And that's why we see adjustable sights on this pistol. This magazine is in immaculate condition. It doesn't look like a round has ever been loaded in it. It just doesn't look like this gun's ever been used. Notice the wide trigger and the left hand grip panel has a very prominent thumb rest which would make it very difficult for left handed shooters to, to be comfortable. This is not comfortable at all. It's got a grip safety, a thumb safety, and a firing pin indicator. When that's to the rear, what it's telling the shooter is that the firing pin is charged to the rear. And the trigger pull feels really good. And these sights are really high quality for um, for just trying to get a pistol imported into the United States. But what's really cool about this handgun is that we have a matching model. And not only is it matching, serial number 71N05526. It's consecutive. Uh, look at that. Really nice set. This is a, uh, a, a really nice pair of pistols. I noticed this here, what is this? Browning 380 Auto, caliber, consecutive serial numbers, Belgium 1971, last production sold as pair. It looks like it was written by the original owner or the salesman who sold it to the owner. Incredible. Thanks for watching, people. Make it a great day.